The most bountiful resource we have in southwest Florida is the Gulf of Mexico and inland waters. Visitors and locals just want to be on or near the water. In the recent past, it was enough for a business to be on the water, but today we have to think outside the box. The newest Southwest Florida half-hour weekly television show, Boaters Treasures, will celebrate the draw of the waterfront and boating. Boaters Treasures will highlight the pleasure of a waterfront meal, a day at the beach, or cruising the secluded islands that dot our coast. Let's not forget fishing the back bay and offshore. Does this sound expensive to you? Probably, but it isn't. Through a series of trades, we will keep the cost to a minimum while enticing the viewers to your waterfront business or a day on a boat. More on that in a minute. Boaters Treasures will defeat the manana syndrome by showing the viewers the fun they could have today. Doing it tomorrow is a malady affecting everyone in our beautiful climate, not just boaters. We'll have them asking, when was the last time we went to the beach or an island? The decline in all water-related activity is certainly economic, but the manana syndrome is a big factor. Boaters treasurers will entice the landlubber to the waterfront restaurants all up and down our coast by highlighting special meals and drinks while concentrating on how great the food tastes along the water. Boaters Treasures will teach the novice boater techniques to make docking easier, fishing more productive, and offshore water something to enjoy safely. In addition to the Vectra Deck boats, uh, we carry a full line of Sentry boats. Uh... Dealer advertising costs were partially deferred by using the dealer's boats during restaurant and how-to shoots. What better way to show the fun of boating? Boating Treasures will entice viewers to visit our advertising businesses by offering discount coupons for sale during the show. Restaurants can trade food and drink coupons and the show will sell them to viewers for 50% off face value. Typically, a $25 coupon would end costing the restaurant around $7 and certain restrictions could apply. These coupons can be charged on a credit card and mailed or left at restaurants for pickup. A boat repair facility might offer a wash and wax, or a boat dealer might have a special rental program for the viewer. Boat rental companies can trade half-day rentals in lieu of cash payments. We hope that you see the benefits of bringing the public to your business and enjoying the adventure that is just a few miles from everywhere. Watch for Boaters Treasures coming this fall on Comcast. Thank you. We just had shrimp scampi. Delicious. Had a fried chicken sandwich. I had uh, buttermilk fried chicken at the Waterfront Restaurant on Pine Island in St. James, James City. City.